All right, let's try this again. I'm having a little uh, connectivity issue. So um, I just want to go over what we uh, talked about yesterday. And this is Sean uh, from Green Relief. And uh, I'm at our Orlando location off of Virginia Avenue. All right, so yesterday we talked about the basic process of how to get uh, your medical marijuana uh, card. And it's a real simple process. Um, we just have two appointments. You can schedule uh, an appointment whatever to whatever location is closest to you. We have three locations here in the Orlando area. We have uh, one in Kissimmee, one here, the one I'm at, on Virginia Avenue, and then we have another one that is on the Curry Ford uh, area. All right, and all you have to do is just give us a call, set up an appointment, and uh, we will get you taken care of. All right. Now, in those uh, consultations, we're going to go ahead. In the first one, we're going to get a baseline of where you're at. So we want to know what your health history, uh, your current health, and we're going to take a look at all of that. All right. And then we're going to submit the paperwork. And then once we get everything back, we can uh, give you a better idea of a treatment plan. All right. Some recommendations of what uh, we should be taking in order to get uh, to the, the point of where we're feeling better. All right. Now, today I want to talk about uh, the different types of uh, the marijuana, the CBD, um, and what each one is used for. And then uh, we have a couple of products that we have uh, to showcase just to let you know, hey, this is an ex example of this, this, and this, and what it does and what it's good for. All right. So uh, there's really two types of uh, marijuana. Okay. So you have your indica and your stativa. And both have a, a really good purpose uh, for whatever it is that you're trying to uh, get better with. All right. Now, your indica, uh, that's usually what I like to describe as from the neck down. Okay. That's more of like uh, your full body. You feel that. Um, it's more of just a relaxing sensation. All right. Now, it's good for reducing stress, uh, for relieving pain, especially in the joints, um, and it can limit anxiety. And so uh, let's just say you have any kind of um, like anxiety attacks or you have insomnia, uh, joint pain, especially with arthritis and mu muscle spasms as well. Um, any kind of stativa or excuse me, indica is going to be really good for that. Now, your stativa, on the other hand, that's what I like to describe from the neck up. Okay, so that's mainly, um, it's more cognitive uh, based, it's good for uh, concentration, um, maybe even some fatigue and uh, mood disorders, things like that, and especially if you have any kind of maybe depression or uh, ADD. So it's good for a good cognitive boost, and again, it's just from the neck up. So that's really the main difference between the two. Uh, so depending on whatever you are suffering from, uh, we can make that recommendation and say, hey, maybe you should be taking indica or maybe you should be taking more sativa. Uh, there is a hybrid uh, classification that kind of involves both. So maybe if you have, uh, you know, maybe a little bit of anxiety, um, you can go ahead and have a, 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 what am I looking for, a hybrid strain that's going to attack both. Um, so, you know, the, again, off, after that second evaluation, we're going to make a recommendation of, of, hey, you should be taking maybe a hybrid strain or maybe a stativa, all right? Um, and that's really the main difference between the two. It's still the same, uh, the same plant, the same great benefits, but we're just specifying what exactly that you're going to have, all right? Um, now, again, it can, it can vary uh, depending on day to day, but you can have different uh, means of consumption. So you don't just have to smoke, you don't have to just eat. There's other ways of doing this. Um, and that's the best part about this is we're gonna be able to recommend uh, anything that's catered to what you're looking for. So if you haven't done so already, go ahead and schedule an appointment. Um, give us a call on the number that I provided in the, um, in the description. Give us a call. Let us know where you're at, um, and we can recommend a location that's closest to you, and we can get you, uh, you know, in the process of getting your green card or your medical marijuana card, and uh, then we can start, you know, giving you some recommendations for feeling better. Now, um, in just a second. I'm actually. I'll show you a couple of things that we are uh, working on right now. And so the first thing that you can do is um, you can use some of the oils um, underneath your tongue, so like a dropper, 
all right? And so generally what this does is it enters the bloodstream really quickly. So whether you're using um, CBD oil or THC oil, um, you're gonna be able to feel that relatively quickly, uh, generally within 15 minutes, and then that's gonna last for anywhere from six to eight hours. Now, um, there is a difference between uh, CBD oil and your THC oil. Um, I'm not going to go too into detail with that right now. That's for another time. But essentially, um, the THC is what gives you the – that's classified as a psych psychoactive substance. Um, that's the sensation of um, – that is stereotypical with your marijuana. Uh, now, we can separate the CBD, which is more – more classified right now, at least, uh, through the federal the federal government as um, therapeutic. So it's both have overlapping benefits, um, but again, the medical marijuana is still composed of CBD and THC. Those are both components to uh, what you are consuming. All right. Now, if you're consuming more CBD, uh, you're not going to have that stereotypical sensation of um, of that high. All right, you're still getting the therapy that you need, uh, but the CBD is just a different sensation. All right, now again, you still have uh, your sativa and your indicas and, um, and those other variations. So that's why I wanted to explain those differences. Um, so the drops are really good, uh, especially if you're looking for, let's say, before bed. Uh, you have insomnia or you have really uh, debilitating arthritis and it's tough for you to fall asleep. Um, we actually have uh, some CBD oil. Uh, these guys are extremely popular right now. Um, I take this myself and it's really good, especially if uh, you are working out a lot or again, you have some kind of arthritis. Uh, it's great to just take a few drops um, depending on, you know, your, your level of, um, uh, your level of experience with this, you're going to be able to, you know, figure out how many drops. Our doctors can go ahead and recommend that. But these are um, our products, at least, are extremely pure with just CBD. I know a lot of companies have a little bit of THC. It's not enough to get you, um, you know, you know that stereotypical high or anything like that. But this, these are uh, nice and pure. You're going to feel really good, especially if you're trying to uh, fall asleep or just kind of uh, ease any kind of pain that you have. And again, these, we have the, what is that, the 150 or excuse me, the 1500 milligrams and then the 2500 milligrams. Um, you know, it's just referring to how much uh, CBD is in each drop and the concentration level. Now, you have the oral uh, administration, as they like to call it, and uh, that's mainly just what we call the edibles. Now, your edibles, um, it's a little bit different because it takes much longer for the body to digest, um, and that is sometimes a little tricky, but typically you'll see, uh, you'll start to feel the effects, excuse me, after uh, two, you know, maybe 45 minutes to two hours, uh, sometimes even longer depending on what you've had to eat and drink throughout the day. Uh, but those effects can last anywhere from four to 12 hours. Um, and that's uh, honestly, you know, if you are, uh, if you're not really, not really up on the drops and you don't want to, you know, have the oil sitting under your tongue for a little bit, you know, I definitely recommend the edibles. That's something that I personally, um, I prefer. Um, it's just really easy to administer. You just pop, pop it in the mouth, chew it up and eat it. Uh, right now, we do have uh, some gummy bears and we'll be having some other products that are rolling out. But again, personally, I prefer the edibles. Um, and the thing that takes a while for the body to digest is it, the liver is actually processing uh, everything. So when that happens, uh, things tend to feel a little bit different. It takes a little bit longer, um, but that's why it takes so long. It's just got to go through the entire digestive system. And once it does, it's, um, I, it's definitely recommended. Um, it is easy, tastes good, especially if you have gummy bears. And uh, the effects are really, really long lasting. So again, if you are maybe having some kind of, um, you know, you're before work or whatever, and you want to have, um, you know, maybe some joint pain again, you want to get through the joint pain, just have a little gummy and be good to go. Um, the next one is actually your vaping. 
Uh, so that is kind of like an oil, uh, but it's actually, you, you might have seen this before, the, there's, um, you know, the, the pens, it's almost, it's just vaporizing uh, that, that oil. Now there's no smoke or anything like that. It's odorless when you uh, exhale and it's just heating up everything. There's no, uh, you know, there's no smoke or flames or anything like that. You're just heating everything up. It's healthier for the uh, respiratory system. And again, we can flavor that. Uh, it's really popular with um, things like like the Juul or uh, any kind of vape uh, that's tried to replace smoking. But this is actually a lot better because you can have CBD, you can have THC. Uh, it's portable and it's very easy. Typically, you can um, you know take a few uh, inhales and you can feel that within seconds. I mean, even minutes. Um, you know, your peak effect of having the the vape. Usually you'll feel that peak within 15 to 30 minutes and that'll last about two to three hours depending on your experience with that. Um, you know, again, very popular. Uh, everybody has, you know, a uh, vape pen now it seems like. So those are uh, definitely recommended as well. Now the last one that's coming around uh, that I haven't seen very often, but uh, we are starting to develop a few things as well. Are the topical creams so we have um, an aloe again with the CBD uh, this is more of the concentrated version and uh, we have another one that's lavender scented as well all right and this is great for if let's just say uh, your hands have really bad arthritis uh, you can go ahead rub that all over your hands just like you would with a, a natural lotion and that's gonna take uh, about less than an hour to really start kicking in uh, and that duration of that is going to be about three to four hours. So once it soaks through the skin, it's going to get into the bloodstream. And it's really going to localize around that area. So think biofreeze, uh, but more of a therapeutic effect. And you're definitely going to notice a difference. It just takes a little bit of time. All right. So um, that's what I wanted to talk about today because there's a lot of things that we can recommend for you. And again, if you haven't gotten an appointment yet, please give us a call. Uh, that's what we're here for. We're here to help you. Okay, so set up your appointment I want you to go ahead and um, call the number that I have in the description and uh, Let us know what location you are near. We've got three of them. We've got one in Kissimmee We've got one here in Orlando uh, off of Virginia Avenue, and then we have one on Curry Ford Road All right, so plenty of locations for you. Um, all of them provide the same thing Get your get your appointment with our medical doctors. Let's get you some recommended uh, therapy and some recommended products. Uh, we're going to be rolling out a lot of different things in the next couple of weeks here. Um, just like I showed you the CBD oil, the topical oil, uh, the edibles, uh, things are you know really starting to look up. It's a really exciting time right now. So if you haven't taken advantage of it, please, I, I encourage you to. And uh, if you have any questions for us, please, that's what I'm doing this for. Um, I'm you know, working with Green Relief in order to get this message out. So even after this live, please let us know what you're thinking, what you wanna hear about. Um, so if you have a question, a comment or anything, leave it on uh, in, in the comments below. You know, Just like it, share it, um, so we can go ahead and, and have a better idea of how to help you guys. Because this can be a little bit uh, intimidating sometimes, especially if you're uh, if you don't have any experience or you've never even thought about this before. Uh, it'll definitely it can be like I said, intimidating. So that's what we're here for. We want to make sure that you guys have the best help and uh, leave us a comment. Let us know what you are thinking and what you are wondering about this whole process. All right. So uh, I will be back tomorrow with a little bit more info and enjoy the rest of your day.